welcome to my floss tube channel thread the needle my name is Bonnie and you're joining me here for my vlogmas day 23 and we're gonna start with my coffee of the day and it's a good one if you know me and you know me at all you'll know that I love candy cane I got super excited when we had a wax melt candy cane flavored I have hand cream candy cane flavored. I've got a coffee mug candy cane. I've, I just love it. Love the smell, the taste, everything. If I could have candy cane all year round, I would do it. Scratch that. I do do that. I have my hand cream with me all the time, all year round. So today our coffee of the day is candy cane flavored. It is called crazy candy cane. It doesn't get better than this. Mm. It's perfect. Perfect. So delish. Now, someone commented on a last video or the video before about what am I going to do when I lose the variety of my daily coffees of the day? Like, how am I going to manage? Do I drink just boring old coffee every day? I'll tell you, coffee is never boring for me. Uh, sometimes I do drink just regular coffee with cream and sugar. Um, but when I want to like change things up a bit, the, what I do is I get the flavored creamer, uh, coffee mate or international delights makes it, uh, and it's, it's the best. Uh, I'll get a French vanilla sometimes I'll get, um, Irish cream sometimes. Most of the times I just get the double, double, uh, which for those non-Canadian friends of mine, um, that is to Tim Hortons, our coffee conglomerate it's uh what you call a double double is two cream two sugar so that's what I normally put in my coffee but during the holiday season they'll come out with new flavors there's an after eight coffee creamer that has a bit of a mint, minty taste to it like those after eight chocolates there's a turtles one I haven't tried that one yet but last year during the holidays they had a coffee crisp creamer you're all familiar with the coffee crisp candy bar well, this was flavored coffee creamer. And let me tell you, it was like dessert in a cup. It tasted amazing. And I have been looking at, and I bought as many as I could and cause they have a long expiry date. So it lasted me until early summer. Then I have been keeping my eye out since the season started and they have not brought it back. I don't know why. I don't know why it was just a special last um, last Christmas, but they haven't brought it back. But anyway, I have been taking this coffee conversation a bit long-winded. Let's just say I'm enjoying my coffee very much today and mm, let's move on. So we have our um, wax melts coming up next. Uh, today is day 23 which is down here. I only have two more wax melts left, which reminds me, I only have one more coffee of the day left because it was a countdown to Christmas that I bought and after tomorrow, it's Christmas. Okay, so I'll just have my regular cup of coffee for my Christmas vlog bus video. Okay, so our wax melt today is a peachy color. pop it out Let's see what it looks like and smells like it's not coming out very easy my goodness gracious oh it's cracking off okay I'm gonna save those little pieces oh but that smells good why is it so difficult to come out today aha got it oh I don't remember if I have this design yet I think I do oh that smells good it's a candle um, let's see. I got wax crumbs all over me. Um, day 23. You know, it's really hard to look for a number and try not read the upcoming numbers. You know what I mean? Uh, are we on 23? Okay, good. Iced gingerbread. It is everything that you would imagine iced gingerbread is. It smells really good. Oh, that 
That's a really good one. Okay, so uh, next up we have my stitching portion of the day. Um, I was stitching on. Mm. I was stitching on uh, Siamese Fighting Fish, and the challenge that I was given was to complete a color all across the page. No, was to stitch the color with the most stitches. Uh, and so that's what I did. So the last time it came around, I think it was the exact same challenge, and the color was 310. Uh, luckily, the page that is there, it's just a small corner left of it, so it was easier challenge to work within. So then I moved on to the next color, which just happened to be 939. And then the color after that was going to be 823. So all those three colors look very much alike when stitched next to each other. So it was a little difficult. And of course, we're stitching on 28 counts. So I'm stitching with one strand, one strand. And that makes it very difficult because you got to be a little careful um, cause I'm a little bit of an aggressive stitcher and after a while the thread starts to fray and then if you pull too hard, it'll just snap. But here's what I got done. And like I said, I got more of the bottom corner of the page done a little bit over here and then over here. So that's where we're to with that one. It's kind of exciting to get back into this one. I'm, I'm hoping that um, I lost the groove last year when I, um, during summer, it was just a really busy summer and uh, I didn't get a lot of stitching done. And then by the time I got back into it in September, October, before you know it, the year was out. So I'm really looking forward to kind of getting back into a routine of my project rotation. Um, and of course, adding a new start for the new year. I'm doing the mystery sale again, guys. So let's move on. Um, today... The project that was selected was between Ganesh and World Travel Bookshelf. And surprisingly, I thought Ganesh would win, but World Travel Bookshelf won. And so that's what I'll be stitching on today. And let's see what the challenge is. There's only two challenges left. So I don't know. My memory is crap. I. I have no idea what I what challenges could be left in there. Ooh, this will work. Stitch red. World Travel Bookshelf is a, a great one to pick a challenge that makes you specify like a color because it has all the colors in it. So this is going to be a fun one today. World Travel Bookshelf, Stitch Red. I want to thank you all for joining me here today for my Vlogmas Day 23. Uh, as always, it has been a joy to come and spend these few moments with you. I wish you all well. Happy holidays. Bye, everyone. Bye.